Hey guys, welcome to Review Radar. In this video, I'll show you how to quickly fix controller input lag on PC. For this method, we will be using a certain application that's called HID USB F. You can download this application by using a link in the video description. All right, so this program is very easy to use. You just download this and unzip it into any folder in your computer, then open up setup file. And in here, everything is very simple as well. Choose all. The devices menu and then you just basically need to find your controller in this list so i'm using my dualshock 4 v2 controller as you can see it is displayed right over here in the child's names category audio endpoint blah 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 wireless controller this is my controller and basically what you need to do you click on this rate number next to your controller and in here under selected rate you need to make sure to click on this drop down and choose a thousand. So a thousand is going to be a maximum overclock for our controller. And this will basically make sure that your input delay is as lowest as possible for your controller. So basically the steps to perform are going to be as such. You found your controller in the list. You click on the right next to it. Then you select thousand in the drop down menu. Then you press on install service. The next step is going to be filtering on device. Just click on this checkbox right over here. After that, click restart. And basically you're done. The only thing that's left to do is to unplug your controller from your PC, plugging it back in, and you will have a lower delay and your input lag will be basically fixed. In case of my DualShock 4, my standard input lag and the delay is going to be 3.5 milliseconds. And this app allows it to be overclocked and it is now reaching a whopping 0.5 millisecond delay so so i basically cut off three whole milliseconds of delay and that's basically how you do it thank you guys for watching hopefully this helps you leave a comment like and subscribe to our channel for more tutorials like this and i'll see you in the next one